Yeah, hey there, it's Stephen Dixon here, the uh, CEO of Breakthrough for Business and the creator of the B4B Academy. I'm gonna be uh, on the online prosperity show with Prosper. Uh, we're gonna be discussing all things uh, about online education and how people can grow and uh, yeah, have a more scalable and profitable business. So uh, come online, I'm gonna be sharing my knowledge on, uh, on things that I've learnt um, in creating this online platform and uh, hopefully it's gonna help out you guys. So come online, listen to me and Prosper and uh, I look forward to seeing you there. Welcome to yet another exciting episode of the Online Prosperity Show. And today, I've brought you the CEO of Breakthrough for Business, Stephen. Stephen, how are you doing, my man? Hey, Prosper, mate. I'm going well. How are you? Fantastic. Thank you so much for making the time today. I mean, viewers, if you're watching this show right now, you probably know by now that our values are to leave, are to learn, and are to contribute. And for you to have a business that's actually profitable and enjoyable, you have to learn from other people. But look at this. Every single time you open your smartphone, there's a blog, there's a video, there's some content that you've got to consume. And it all seems like you've got to be consuming from the fire hose. But it's not going to be like that for long. Steven and his crew at Breakthrough for... for, for Steven, you're going to have to help me with this. Breakthrough for Business have come up with a platform where you can actually learn and also ask questions, get advice, stay connected with other business owners um, throughout the world on their new forum. Now, already I'm already mincing my words, Stephen, and I don't want this to spoil the good thing you've created. Tell us a little bit about your B4B Academy um, platform that you've just created there, Sam. Thanks, Prosper, mate. I thought you did really well then. I didn't think you meant your words too bad at all. Mate, um, yeah, we've got a, an online platform called The Academy. We've uh, uh, basically created something so that we can have a greater impact um, to people, not just in, in Australia, but all around the world. Uh, like you said, the, there's, there's plenty of information out there. Um, but how people receive the information, I think, moving forward into the future is going to be quite critical as to how they learn. Um, people get overwhelmed. There's, there's that much volume of, of content out there that they don't know where to turn. So what we've tried to do inside the academy um, is to create a platform where people can not only learn, you know, the knowledge component of what we're doing is only one small part. Uh, we're trying to humanize the experience and create connection and community inside an online platform, uh, which we don't feel has been done anywhere before. So we, we're trying to um, there's, there's four components to it. There's a knowledge component, uh, but there's also three other components, which is community, uh, support, and also accountability. And I think the reason we've done that is because we really want uh, to connect with people. And um, just giving people information isn't enough anymore. We, we want to be able to connect with people, share the information, and then maybe, you know, share the journey with them. Because it's important, you know, just talking to you now, we've not met before, but we've had a good chat for 10 minutes and, and I already love you, mate. I think you're a great guy. So connection is, is the key to connecting good people. And, I, and I'm, that's our intention with the Academy. Absolutely. Well, <clears throat> thank you so much for that elaboration there. And one thing that we all know as entrepreneurs is we are here to serve and to fill a need. What are people really missing out on now if they're not jumping on the B4B Academy uh, yeah. platform? Um, what are they missing out on? Good question. Uh, they're missing out on the ability to learn, grow and connect. Um, and, and when I say to learn, I mean, everybody has got the resources around them to be able to learn. Um, but sometimes there can be a huge disconnect from people walking into a seminar, uh, whether it be here or overseas, you know, they'll learn a heaps of heaps of information. And I've done it before in my early days, uh, where you'd walk into a seminar, you'd spend three or four days there, you'd get so much information, and then you go, great, I'm going to implement and execute on all that great stuff. But then you get back into the workplace, nothing happens. All right, the phone rings, and then that's that's the most important thing. So you answer that, and then you put that down, and you go to start, and you answer an email. And all of a sudden, the effectiveness of those three or four days of learning gets diluted. You know, every hour that you don't implement after you learn something, the, the chances of you executing on that knowledge become less and less. It diminishes. 
So what we, you know, what our intention is with the academy is that we want to stay connected with good people. We want to help them along the journey. We want to hold their hand if they want to be held their hand. If if they want that, then we can do that. If they if they want to be held accountable, even if they just want to share their wins. Uh, one of the, one of the things that we found, and I run a program here in Wollongong. Uh, so as much as we've got the, the academy online, we've also got a program here called Breakthrough for Business in Wollongong, uh, where we have a small VIP group of you know roughly 30 people. And it's all about community and it's all about connection. And, and really what the academy's intention to do is, is try to do that in a, in a much larger scale, but connecting good people. Absolutely. <clears throat> I'm African. Yep. In case you haven't noticed, um, but um, in in our tribe, we've got this statement. I think it was um, uh, then made famous by uh, Nelson Mandela or somebody of that nature. That if you want to go far, you go alone. But if you really want to go further, you yeah. go together. You keep reiterating um, the essence of uh, community. Um, having people in different levels um, of business is actually very, very helpful. But um, don't you find that people find that as a negative uh, in as much as they don't want to show their vulnerability side um, by being um, amongst people that are already accomplished? Yeah, for sure. And that's um, with the academy, people can sit back if they want. They don't have to share in the in the community initially they they can just watch the you know the traffic go on and they can just watch comments as much as they want to if they want to get involved you can get involved um but small business it's a lonely journey sometimes very it's very difficult to be able to have an honest conversation with someone and be able to say prosper i'm really struggling um i, I don't know what to do we've got these challenges and i don't know what to do now and another another saying that i've sort of um i've heard along the along my travels is a mountain that you can climb by yourself is not a big enough mountain so by by sharing the journey with others you calling on other people's experiences and knowledge and the way that we can do that is just keep building an amazing community and, and that's really what the core focus is the knowledge is important i think the community and the people component of our platform is even more important um, it's, it's just particularly around regional Australia. We've been working with the federal government actually to, to help, you know, connect people throughout regional Australia. I mean, you look at our country prosper. How big is it? It's massive. <laughs> it takes forever to go from one side to the other. And inside that middle area, there's so much space, but there's communities inside that space. Um, and we want to give them the same level of business education as what you can get in the major cities. And at the moment, that, that's a real challenge for us in Australia. But I hope, you know, with, with what we're doing inside the academy, we, we hope that we're going to provide a, a good solution for that. Absolutely. And um, a lot of the people that you're connecting are, you know, people from, you know, different states in Australia. And you've also now ventured with the platform to go to an overseas uh, customer base. Do you find that there's probably a difference in uh, maybe time differences or differences in procedures, um, you know, systems that actually happen in running a business between different countries? Does that pause um, as a learning curve or does that, is that a deterrent for people? Because some people just really want to know what's happening within their own, um, you know, spectrum. What would people learn by, you know, being mixed with people from other countries? Yeah, well, I think there's a real benefit to uh, actually broadening your, your horizons. Um, we, I mean, Australians, we, we're very entrepreneurial. And I, know, I hope that everybody's watching this, you know, congratulations, because it's, it's not easy running a business these days. And, um, you know, people are traveling their, their journey that they want to travel, which I've got so much respect for. Uh, when you, you look over to the States, though, particularly, if, because we, we're going into to New Zealand, uh, we're looking at the UK, but the States is probably the biggest market for us. Um, they're much more open to things like ours, like education. They just love it. They lap it up. Um, and they just want more and more. So I don't, you know, the amount of money they spend on educating themselves is crazy. It's, it's just so much money. Whereas in Australia, we're a little bit more sceptical. You've got to win people's trust before that you can really even talk about, well, what are we going to do? What are we going to go to the next level? Um, don't even try and do that yet. You've got to add in layers of trust 
um, to people, business owners, particularly in Australia, because really we, we've got our guard up a lot. And, and I do as well. When people come over and I go into the big conferences, I think, what's this guy trying to sell me? Or is he genuinely, or are they trying to genuinely help me? Because a lot of them are. Um, but yeah, when, when we talk about venturing into overseas markets, uh, we actually built the academy platform with the vision of going international. Um, the stepping stone was to gradually go from our region into New South Wales, into Australia, then international, then by sort of targeting individual countries. So um, yeah, I, I think the world we live in now, uh, you, you've got to think globally. You know, if you achieve that or not, it's not the point. But you've got to think on a global scale, no matter how big or small your business is. Absolutely. I like that you've woven that in because Wollongong is not one of the biggest cities in Australia, <clears throat> but you do house a university. So that's, you know, your, the claim to fame. But um, a lot of business people would just be thinking that their service area is just the little people and, you know, um, the, the people they go play bingo with or the people they actually meet at a barbecue um, yeah. within their butts. Like you say, the world has become global and yeah. that actually opens up people to, um, you know, cl customers that they wouldn't have thought they would have gotten, um, you know, on their own. So, you know, bringing that aspect of trust, bringing that aspect of knowing, um, you know, who to deal with because people do business with those that they know, like, and trust. What are the business opportunities of people that, you know, um, start working in this academy um, since there's a community that's being formulated? Is there an opportunity that trade can actually happen and is that facilitated or are people just coming to consume? Yeah, not really. We, I mean, they can do it. I mean, we, we do have sort of moderate the forum. So the forum is one sort of part of uh, the academy. It's not just the forum. There's, there's you know, you know, over 300 hours of live videos in there. We're doing webinars inside. Um, and one of the most important things we've done is we, we've, I think we've done over 55 online tools. We've broken them all down into step-by-step -step processes. That, that's actually one of the most important parts of the academy, uh, the online tools that people can go on and learn how to use. Um, but your question was, can people trade through inside the academy? There's no reason that people can't communicate with each other, um, share their knowledge. As long as everybody's there playing with, I guess, what we call a servant's heart. It, it's how can we help others? It's not how much I can take. It's how much I can give. And that's the premise for the forum in there is how much can we get everybody in there playing an awesome game where we just want to help everybody? Because if everybody goes in there with the inclination of just wanting to take, how much can I get out of this platform? then we just see a whole bunch of people that are trying to pull towards themselves. Whereas if we, if we build a platform and we, we have a platform where people are giving, giving great knowledge, you know, supporting each other, championing each other, then that's an amazing place to be. And if that then translates into people doing business together, well, the Academy can be a lead generating facility where then you can take your conversations offline. Absolutely. Because some people will be looking at it and saying, oh, okay, while I'm learning, is there somehow that I can, you know, you know, get to expand my business in, in, in a way. So we figured out that you, you don't have to be physically in Wollongong. You can access this platform from wherever in the world. And we've also figured out that there is a community, um, you know, where people, you know, coming from all walks of life are in and at different levels. So you can actually learn, um, without having to drink from the fire hose of what the internet has turned out to be. So what sort of, um, and you've mentioned that you've got over 300 hours of, um, you know, video that you have curated together. So what sort of content is to be expected or what sort of topics do you cover, um, you know, that are of importance to somebody who's a small business um, owner? Yeah. And once again, that sounds like a lot of content. People go, wow, 300 hours. But you can consume that as you see fit. You don't have to go and watch all 300 hours at once. That, that doesn't make sense. Um, so basically over the last, this is our sixth year of running um, events here in Wollongong through Breakthrough for Business. So we hold events every three months. Um, the topics that we, um, we cover, so the, the big ones like sales, marketing, uh, social media, uh, leadership, 
uh, we've got great videos in there on systems and automation. So how, how can you create systems in your business to, to become even more efficient, to become more profitable? So that's something I'm a big believer in. I, uh, I've been in business for 15 years and, and for, for most, for 14 years of that, I had a sportswear business, which, you know, I had, you know, 40 staff across four countries and I worked my butt off. But we systemized the whole process so that at the end of the 14 years, I was able to sell it and not work as hard as what I did. But I had to go through that journey of me working very hard to learn that systems and automation are important. So we've got a, we've got a big section on systems and automation. We've got things like personal development. You know, we've got some of the best speakers from around Australia uh, inside of the academy who I've been very, very grateful that they've, uh, they've come down to Wollongong. We've flown them all in from, from Perth, Brisbane, you name it, they've come in. Um, to share their knowledge so there's uh yeah social media digital marketing um you know how how you can create a great website we've got um yeah just some fantastic speakers in there so they're the main ones we've got some motivation um sections in there as well uh and that's you know it's just what you need right now you know we've got 12 different categories so you just go to the category you want if you want to increase your sales you go to the sales category and you can see, I think we've got, you know, 13 different presenters there on that topic. Just go and pick the one that you like, you know, gravitate towards, grab a, grab a coffee. If it's, you know, grab a glass of red, grab a beer, whatever it is, grab a glass of water and just sit and, and listen at your own pace in your own home. And if you don't listen, if you, if you watch something and you don't understand it, just go back and rewind it and watch it again. Absolutely. That makes it sound so easy and very, very convenient for that, um, you know, struggling entrepreneur who's working day and night in order for them to be, do and have a business that's profitable and enjoyable. But Stephen, all of this sounds, because if I'm scrolling through the internet, um, every course that I'm going through to, if it's any good, it's something around the $3,000 mark. If it's any conference that I have to go to, it's probably a Tony Robbins conference where I walk on water or walk on calls or whatever they're doing these days and I have to part with $21,000. Or if I'm going to be going to uh, some live um, you know, educational summit where I'm streaming still in the comfort of my home, at least wearing pants this time, but I'll be paying like $1,000 um, yeah. you know, for, for, for me to get access to just touch the hem of the people that are uh, on there. So what, what, what you've been talking about here really, really sounds like, um, you know, something of that sort of caliber, it's high quality, so much content and it really must be expensive then. Yeah. yeah. So what we've done, um, and you've, you've led me to it. Well, um, so it's $47 a month to be part of the academy. So it's, Only. it's an inexpensive way. So it's basically two coffees a week. Wow. Uh, and the reason we've done that, and, you know, I've been blasted for that, saying, you know, it's too cheap, uh, or whatever else. That's fine. I'm, I, I'm always open to listening. But at the end of the day, I don't know about you, Prosper, but um, if I believe something, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stick to what I believe. And I believe that if we can make this accessible to everybody, and I'm not just talking about the people who can afford it. I'm talking about everybody. $47 a month is a nice little number where people go, right, I can do that. I can do that. And then you've got it. You've still got to participate. You've still got to get in there. You've still got to learn. Otherwise, it's a waste of $47 a month. Absolutely. I want people that are going to pay it, but are going to use it so they can get in there and just incrementally learn and get better at what they do in business. And then I want them to get into the forum and I want to share what they've learned and, you know, what, what their wins were. You know, I've, you know people can go in and um, there's a wonderful tool called Jing for, for screen uh, recording. You know, if people go in there and they learn about this new tool that they can use to help them grow their business and become more efficient and communicate, I'd love for them to share. Thanks so much for sharing, you know, how to use Jing from that, you know, from those steps I've now been able to do X, Y, Z. It's about helping people. That's, that's what this is all about. It's, you know what, economies of scale, if we get, you know, a thousand people, 10,000, you know, I want to get a million users inside of the academy. That's whatever. The, the money's going to become as a consequence of helping people. But first and foremost, you know, our main core ambition is just to help people. Everything else will come.
So the money, how much it costs, um, it's what it's valued at. I mean, how much do people value something like this? That's what I'm more interested in. If they think it's worth 500 a month, that's great. But um, there's people out there that can use it and, and just get some value. That's what it's all about. Absolutely. I think we were talking a little bit earlier on and saying how the internet is bloated with information and um, consumers or people that are out there are no longer, um, you know, being because because now there's all this fake news people don't know what's right and what's not and you know the the way even facebook can't even um you know determine which is a good source and which is not a good source that's why they just got rid of pages altogether and if you find somebody who's actually sitting there and curating all that information for you in the comfort of your home pants are you know <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> optional optional whatever yeah. <laughs> that's so you know, true and, but, and at 47 dollars a month i think this is something that um if if you really want to start learning and you want to be amongst a community of people that are heading somewhere and people that are actually experimenting um on human beings and not on animals you know you would know that this this should be a way um to 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 go ahead now i mean obviously steve this, this is actually um, a really good platform. And just for somebody who's sitting at the edge of their chair right now, figuring out, um, you, know, you know, how else can they benefit? Do you have any sort of success stories or a success story that you can just highlight so that, you know, it could just tip the next person across? Um, success stories from using the academy. Well, basically we've had uh, within our group in, um, in our VIB, VIP group for Breakthrough for Business. Uh, we've been able to show people how to use tools like Jing um, is a really important one. Like I spoke about before, it's a screen sharing thing. Um, but we've also, one of the key ones, I guess, um, is, is one of our members was go, able to go in and use a program called Entreport. Entreport is a CRM that helps you systemize your business and um, stores your database. So you can start to contact people um, regularly you know, in a, in a systemized manner and it's all automated. So um, one of the people that was inside of the academy wanted to use Entreport. They were so confused because it, uh, you look at their dashboard, it can look a little bit like a cockpit of an airplane where you go, oh my gosh, I'm overwhelmed, I'm out, you know, I've, and that's the biggest challenge. Once, once you get too confused, you, your mind just shuts down and you go, oh, this, this animal's, this thing's a beast. I don't know how to use it. Um, what they were able to do by using the step-by-step -step processes inside of Entreport was they were able to set up sequences for their website so that they were able to create a, an opt-in on a landing page. And then they were able to send in, I think there was a sequence of four emails that when someone opted in and entered their username, uh, name and email address, they got a sequence of four emails, uh, which helped their conversions. I don't know what the actual metrics on how much that helped their conversions, but the feedback we got was that they were able to go through the the step by step processes if for entreport to show them exactly how to use it step by step not confusing but just really simple <laughs> and that's where it helps because man it's confusing and i feel for you know we've got older generations younger generations we've got the ones in the middle and they're just trying to keep up at the moment and, and absolutely absolutely uh, i i know when it comes to email and you know all those systems behind the scenes making sure the tags are right making sure the email goes in at the exact time it, it can be really really confusing and um, a lot of you know uh, consultants out there are um, paying I mean are charging top dollar for people to learn that and if somebody can just learn that at $47 a month a yeah. month all the other things that they can learn then that is a steal because the, 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 the clients that you'll be able to get the money that you'll be able to save, um, you know, by actually reaching out to those people and having an automated system, do it for you while you're sleeping. Then I think there's so much value to be earned um, when it comes to your platform right there. Now, how, how can people get a hold of this? I mean, if we keep selling this, they might run away. Yeah, thanks, man. Uh, the The website is www.b4b, so b the number four b dot academy, uh, and that'll get you to the um, that'll get you to the homepage, and then you can just register from there. Uh, there's no contracts. I mean, like if you can get in there, you take all the information you want. 
you can leave after one month. It doesn't matter. It's like 47 bucks spent. But if you want to stay in there and just continue and, and play the game, be part of the community, grow together. You know, that, that sense of belonging that you can go in there and post a question in a safe environment. It, it's, you know, it builds confidence. And confidence gives us the ability to move forward. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, I can't thank you enough because obviously at the end of the day, you know, people are suffering from this, you know, information overload and you have taken it upon yourself to, um, you know, make it easier for them into bite sized uh, bits that they can actually, you know, consume at their own pace with a community that actually cares um, you know, about their success without them, you know, getting worried about not knowing what, what move to go to and what other thing, you know, to, 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 to tackle within their business. So this is actually something that even I would con seriously consider um, jumping on. Now, we've just started a new uh, month in a uh, new year. Obviously, people had their resolutions for January, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So it's still fresh in their heads. Do you have any sort of last words that you can give as an encouragement to people that are, um, you know, studying their business, or they need to learn more, or they're just in limbo as to where should I go to next within their business? Because all you can do is all you can do, really. Yeah, yeah. Well, um. You know, I learned this thing from a guy by the name of Taki Moore, who, who I think he learned it from Dan Kennedy. And I'll, like, like you say, you sort of, nothing's really that new anymore. You sort of, you talk about things that you learn from other people. So a guy by the name of Taki Moore told me this thing. If you can reverse engineer it, so if you can look out to the end of 2018, just say you end of 2018 and you look back at the year that you've had, what would make it an amazing year for you? So if you're starting out in business or you've, potentially got an amazing year ahead of you, you need to understand what does the end look like? So when you get to the end of this year, what do you want to have done? So how does it look? How does it feel? And then you basically say, well, I've done this, this, and this. Great. Now you've got to set in place those things. You know, if you want to do four public speaking gigs in the next 12 months to, um, to help grow your business and grow your profile, well, you better start looking now. Either you run your own, you know, workshops, that means you've got to lock in the dates and you've got to commit to it. But if you play a big game, that's what I would say to people. Don't think small. Play a big game. Be audacious with your thoughts. We play on a global scale. We need big thinkers. So think about well, how you want it to be during this year. Go and put yourself, you know, 31st of December 2018. What does it look like? What have you done? Then you think back, right, that's what I want to do. And go and do it. Absolutely. That is very powerful because I think it was Steve Jobs that also has the same sort of thing that says you can only connect the dots, um, you know, looking backwards. You cannot connect the dots looking forward. So if you get to your end destination, just like with a GPS, um, you don't put the, 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 the address of where you are. You tell it where you want to go and then it just navigates back to where you want to go. So it makes it a whole lot easier. And if you've got, um, you know, your, your, your end in sight, things are easier for you to navigate. Absolutely phenomenal right there. So, I mean, a lot of people are trying to learn. A lot of people are trying to grow at the same time. And if you don't have direction or people that are actually, you know, um, in the same sort of, um, you know, wavelength as you, you might just be uh, treading in the water and going nowhere really fast. So it is advisable to join the B4B Academy where... Yep have actually curated all the information that you might need to leave, learn and grow um, so that you have a business that's profitable and enjoyable. Now, Steve, I can't thank you enough for your time, your expertise and your knowledge on the show today. Thank you so much. Thank you, Prosper. It's been wonderful being uh, on the show. And congratulations, mate. You've done an amazing job. Absolutely. Thank you so much too. Bye for now. Bye for now.